Welcome back, everyone, to my poetry hour. <clears throat> Sorry. Um, still getting over this cold I had earlier in the week. And I just wanted to say thank you guys so much. Everyone who's listening, whether you're listening to this or my erotic or my Halloween stories or whatever, I appreciate you guys so much. I'm at my goal for the year. I reached my goal And I'm ready to go beyond that goal for the next year. And I have over 10,000 people listening to me. So I really appreciate it. And I've been putting down different stuff. But I realized I haven't put out just regular poetry without any erotic themes or anything in a while. So why don't I do that? I'm going to give you guys a little bit more music, and then we're going to get into some poems, okay? The first one I'm going to do is called Smoker's Thoughts. And we're not going to ask why it's called that. We're just going to go with it. Thinking and smoking. Thinking and smoking. Trying to figure out what's my next move. Trying to keep my mind off of the pain of this broken heart. Trying to keep reminding myself I got to keep going. I can cry later. Reminding myself, you can heal. Reminding myself, I have other goals to achieve. And maybe this was never meant to be in a relationship. Maybe this person was never meant for me. Maybe love wasn't meant for me, period. Maybe I need to stop thinking I'm messing up my high. And that is Smoker's Thoughts. And by the way, I have a part two of that, which I'm about to do. So, Smoker's Thoughts, part two. Once again, don't ask me why these are called Smoker's Thoughts. You'll figure out really quickly. Smoking and thinking. Thinking and smoking. Smoking and thinking. I think and I feel like I'm done with love. And I'm not saying this just because I'm heartbroken still. I'm not saying it. I'm not saying this because the last person I gave my heart to still has it. Thinking and smoking, smoking and thinking. I rather focus on my future. And make my money moves. I'm just done with getting my hopes up and falling in love and trusting people. I'm done with loving someone more than they will ever love me. Thinking and smoking, smoking and thinking. It's crazy. God, I gotta stop thinking like this. It's fucking up my high. And that was Smoker's Thoughts, part two. So, I think we're going to do one more on here. And that one is called Dating Yourself. Might do a couple more later, but right now, I'm going to do this one. I 
feel like everyone I feel like everyone should date themselves. Now, before you get now before you think I'm crazy, hear me out. Especially after you've been through so many bad breakups, so many bad exes, maybe we need to take a step back and get to know ourselves a lot more before we let someone else in there. We all want to be we all want to be in love. We want to all find our soulmates or our twin flames and have our happily ever uh, happily ever afters. But I feel like maybe we need to take a step back and get to know what we want. Take yourself out. Spoil yourself. If you want to go on a fancy vacation out of town, take yourself on that vacation and do all the things that you expect a significant other to do and beyond. I know, I know it sounds crazy, but then you know in your then you know to yourself exactly what you expect and what you will accept and what you're not going to accept. Which will be nothing less than what you can give yourself. And that was dating yourself. And once again, I just want to say I appreciate you guys so much. And it means a lot that you guys have been standing behind me and liking my poems and liking my stories, everything. And just like everything, keep it going because it's pushing me. It's motivating me. Because it was a minute I almost thought I wasn't going to get back to podcasting and seeing my numbers rise in between the last time I podcast was Valentine's Day till now that was huge for me and I was kind of in some dark places which I'm going to talk about on another show but I just really want to tell you guys I appreciate you guys I love you guys and just keep keep motivating me keep it up and I will keep giving you content I promise you guys and follow me on instagram and twitter at poet soul 30 i post all my new poems any like exclusive content any like that anything like that it's dropping on there first because sometimes it takes me a little bit longer you can't tell to do podcast but with that being said i hope you guys have a great day and thank you so much and i will post in the description my Instagram and my Twitter. They're both the same thing at Pulitzer 30. But uh, thank you guys so much. I appreciate you guys and I love you guys. Bye.